There, there it is, folks. Variable speeds. So uh, a lot of people are saying. I, I know the motor motor manufacturers recommend on a lot of motors that a variable speed not be used, but I have a specific Dayton model. Oh crap! I almost could remember it. I was looking at. I had to order one uh, a while ago because I I want to get one to replace that because that's not the same model that I have. I don't think. And it's not quite as strong, so I didn't have a spare because I uh, hadn't ordered them in a while. But anyway, there's variable speed, and I use that quite often, by the way. And I have some of them inside, I'll show you in just a minute, that I've never had a motor bear uh, burn out. Bearings and all that, yes, motor, no. So say what you want to, it works. There is. Uh, little blower right there you can hear the difference in the motor I believe let me stick it right up here close all right that's me just moving the uh, vent control here's the variable rheostat then there's this almost too slow for anything and that's back up again okay so that works now that fan was on a rheostat and I had it on I forgot what I had that on but I pulled it off and I forgot what exact what model was now here's another one this is a vacuum cleaner motor uh, when I bought the rafting company it was here and that's what they used to air up the rafts with but uh, I'll let you see it too That right there would be more air than what you'd ever need for a forge, but it runs nice and smooth, don't it? And that runs nice and smooth. Motors don't heat up or anything like that, All right? So I'm gonna show you a couple more of them I got inside, just so so you know. Whenever I say that I've got variable motors on variable rheostats. The ones inside, bearings, only replace them when the bearings go out. So for those of you guys that say that that doesn't work, you're dead wrong. Sorry. There might be some motors out there that won't, uh, won't take one. I know brushless motors won't, obviously. But uh, for every other motor that I can think of, hook up a rheostat. It'll be just fine. Compressor motors, done that before, yes. Uh, I had one that was... 3,700 RPMs, I think. I want to back it down to 1,700. Uh, there's one over there on that 2x72 belt grinder that I've had rheostat hooked up on. In fact, if you notice where this is plugged in right here, that orange wire is plugged in right there. And and so is the going to that other fan, so I can test motors really quick. Plus, I have uh, another... Uh, what they call router speed control that you can just plug a wire into. I haven't found a motor yet that won't work on a variable rheostat. And I've used enough of them for a long enough time with the rheostats to know that they don't burn out because of that. So cheers. I'd just like to correct the record. And some other blowers that I have. That's a heat exchanger. There's a blower right there, and if you can see down there, there's a blower back there. You might be able to see it better over here. And that's uh, a fan going into the back of the wood stove on the end of that. And there is the two, uh, wow, that's bright. There's the two, uh, what do you call it, uh, sliding dimmer switches that are used to... Uh, operate that let's see 121 degrees yeah both of them will come on i have two fans one of them uh let me get my other hand free one of them
Now, one of them blows out of the front. There's two five sixteenths inch boiler tubes. And then down here, there's two tubes up underneath there. I don't know if you can see them or not. Plus that one right there. Now you can tell that that's been there for a little while. And I've never had a fan go out because of electrical problems. They always go out because the bearings wear out. And you can see that they're quite a ways away from the blower. That one is, uh, I guess, or from the heater, I guess. That one's probably a good 16 inches away. And the one down on the bottom is about that far. They really never get that hot because you got air moving through them and all that. So, anyway, there's some more of them.